Hello everyone, welcome to Man Maker. I am Ranjan Kumar Kalindi, and today onwards we are going to start a new class or new series for quantitative aptitude. Okay, so whatever exam you are preparing for, any competitive exam, any government exam, or any campus selection like placement exam, whatever you are preparing in that quantitative aptitude will be there. So either it is RRB exam, SSC exam, JPSC, banking, ISRO, DRDO, any exam where you find aptitude, then you have to uh, complete this series. Okay. So in this series or in this class, what we are going to do is we are going to cover all the chapter, and in that chapter we are going to cover questions in a type wise. Type wise question I am going to tell you in a one. chapter like how many type uh, types of question they will ask in exam so we are going to discuss all about this all these things using shortcut method and we are going to cover full chapter okay so first we'll see the syllabus how it is so if you see quantitative aptitude syllabus then you will find number system will be there simplification scf and lcm average ratio and proportion partnership percentage time and work like that all the things are there in aptitude uh, quantitative aptitude but what we will do we will make little bit simple to this syllabus and we will divide this syllabus in a section wise okay so you will feel little bit easy like if we see quantitative aptitude we can divide or you uh, we can uh, make it section in a six way means six section if we divide in a six section then it will be easy to cover this aptitude syllabus so this things in a section 1 like this is a part 1 if you consider this one in a part 1 number system simplification and scf and lcm this is what this is the basic thing this is the basic for aptitude if you know this basic things then you can able to solve what aptitude questions so this is what basic mathematics this thing you have to know okay once we you will complete these things then you can go to other section part 2 in part 2 like average ratio and proportion partnership and problem on age so if you know these two concept average and ratio and proportion then you can easily solve this part, uh, partnership and problem on age syllabus with this concept only whatever uh, uh, concept we will discuss here that uh, will be useful for partnership and problem on age okay so like suppose this average is there okay first chapter suppose average is there so what we will do we will go type wise in a average chapter how many types of the question are there uh, which they are asking in exam everything we are going to cover and that type of question uh, we are going to cover with shortcut methods okay shortcut methods we uh, shortcut method we will use so uh, if you use this method then uh, what benefit you will get uh, get like uh, uh, see quantitative aptitude uh, most of the student already cover this syllabus whatever syllabus is there uh, already they have covered but still they are facing um, facing to solve question in the exam so the thing is what uh, exam they will not ask like uh, you already cover syllabus or you know all the concept or no or not they will ask only time management how you are utilizing your time they will check that thing okay so if you see like in a exam what they will do like for 60 question you have 60 minutes for 50 question you have 50 minutes sometime you will get for one, uh, solving one question it will take uh, it will be like 30 second you will get time so this time management is very important so for that you have to go through shortcut route you have to know shortcut method how you will solve any question without using any formula i am going to cover all the syllabus without you uh, uh, using any formula uh, means i will try you will not get any formula you not have to remember any formula only i will tell you concept in that concept only this aptitude chapter will be cover likewise if you come to this percentage section means this section part 3 section so here if you know this percentage things means how to solve percentage and what kind of what type of questions are there in percentage 
that if you know then you can easily solve this profit and loss simple interest and compound interest then mixture and allegation all these are related to each other whatever section i have divided uh, means all these are related to each other if you know one concept one chapter at least then you can go for all other three chapter so like if you solved all if you uh, cover already syllabus then you must remember this uh, profit loss formula simple interest formula compound interest formula so many formulas are there in this chapter but i am not going to tell you any kind of formula i will tell you other method in that method you have not to use any formula you have not remember you did not have to remember any kind of formula just one or two concept is there if you know that thing you can easily solve the um, any question so the thing is if you go in this way then you can solve any question uh, in a less than one minute or by seeing only question you no need to uh, take your pen also by seeing option you can easily solve that question likewise if you know this pipe and work then you can easily solve this pi uh, uh, oh, sorry time and work if you know then you can easily solve this pipe and system formula uh, means uh, questions then speed and time and distance and bot and stream so likewise each are related to each other then if you come to this section in this section only uh, they will feel little bit uh, this uh, section is hard so in this section you have to little bit remember you have to remember this algebra formula trigonometric formula and mensuration in this section only you have to remember little bit formula or i will tell you other concept also other trick also by seeing option also you can solve the question but sometime you need to apply some formulas okay so here only you have to use little bit formula otherwise in a, uh, in other section you no need to remember any formula now coming to this section this section for mainly for banking people banking and also this rrb railway exams are going uh, it will start soon so rrb and ssc this uh, this section for those only mainly for those so here also no need to remember any kind of formula and all if you know the concept you can solve the uh, any kind of question okay so we are going to uh, start this class from the next video or next class uh, so uh, you have to make notes very like uh, carefully and all type wise you have to write all these things i am going to cover all the chapter with a type wise question so just cover that one once you will cover this uh, aptitude syllabus uh, then in the future you no need to again and again uh, again and again you have to cover the syllabus okay once you know this these things then you have to be in a revision mode only after that like uh, you can easily score a good marks in a aptitude section okay so very soon we will uh, not soon from next day onwards you are going to get a one uh, one chapter uh, uh, means one in one class i will try to cover one chapter or it will take uh, two videos to cover one chapter like that and we will discuss each exam means whatever exam happened till now that question we are going to cover with that concept only okay so till then uh, we'll meet in the next class if you are new in this video uh, in channel just subscribe my channel so we will be in touch for a long time and just share these things with your friends okay thank you